Seven meters a second. We've acquired the ground with the radar. Now two to the eight kilometers. Feet have separated, separated. we've found we the ground. Tones due to earth occultation as expected. We're using by to prime the MLE engines in preparation for power flight. We're down to 90 meters per second at an altitude of 6.5 kilometers in descending. <laughs> Slight EDL, we've got some Tweedo warnings. It is in battle short is. mode, so it should power through them. Director of Communications at this time. We may have lost it already. We're down to 86 meters per second at an altitude of 4 kilometers and descending. We have lost, act we've lost tones from Earth at this time. This is expected. Uh, we are continuing on Odyssey telemetry. Ground solution equals minus 10.8 meters, vertical velocity of minus 82.8 meters per second. We are priming power to start enabled, standing by for batch cell separation. Signal to Odyssey is still strong. We are in powered flight. Yeah. We're at altitude of one kilometer descending. About 70 meters per second. Signal to Odyssey oh, remains air. down to 50 meters per second. 500 meters in altitude. Yes. Standing by for sky crane. Constant velocity, accordion, nominal. Altitude error, 5.9 meters. We found a nice flat place. We're coming in ready for sky crane. Down to 10 meters per second. 40 meters altitude. Sky crane has started. Descending at about 0.75 meters per second as expected. Expecting bridal cut shortly. <laughs> Tango to us, you remain strong. Tango Delta nominal. Oh. Yeah, uh, you do a calm configure. Review stable. Review stable. Review stable. Oh, you Jeff is good. <laughs> Touchdown confirmed. We're safe on live. <laughs>
We are wheels down on Mars. This is actually just Oh my God. So do a proper hug on the other side. Keep watching, guys. Keep watching the stream. There's more stuff. Any minute now. Yeah. No. 2.56. Okay. Well, okay. So here we are. We're going to start. Go ahead. Okay. So we have landed. We landed out at the time we thought we would. And we now have our first image. We have our first image. Um, this we've got it's a 64 by 64 thumbnail. The front, a rear has cam image. You can see the shadow there. Um, I'm, I'm not sure exactly which our orientation is of the vehicle, but uh, we're looking through it. In a few, I think in a, just a few minutes we might get even a, a, two, a, a larger 250 to 256 uh, frame uh, 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 pixel image um, of that same same end. So we're looking at the shadow. See the horizon is actually in the distance. You can't really tell that. So we're looking actually at the shadow of the late afternoon sun. Uh, and uh, well, uh, so these are the rear house cams. These are the rear house cams. And, and it so does have a dust cover on it. It does point. have a dust cover, but it's the dust that covers the problem. It's the fact there's dust in the air because we have just blown dust all over the place with our descent engines. Fantastic. So there could be more. There could be more. If we get, if we wait, we might get, oh yeah! Ah! This is the high res, this is the 256 by 256 image. This is a higher res, you see dust particles on the window. Uh, you can see the horizon there in the background. And there is, there is the wheel of the rover safely on the surface of Mars. I can't believe this, it's unbelievable. We, should, we might get another one of these, and if we're lucky, before Odyssey goes away, we'll get two more of these same injuries going the other side of the vehicle, and also probably dusty. This is amazing. <laughs>